A look at Times Square this morning where snow is already starting to come down as the Northeast braces for a massive winter storm. Now the National Weather Service says nearly two feet of snow could fall on New York at a rate of two to four inches per hour. Sunday, the storm pushed up the East Coast and dropped more than a foot of snow in Aurora, West Virginia and 11 inches in parts of Maryland. And it was the biggest snowstorm in two years in our nation's capital, dropping to two to four inches. Uh, across the region with freezing temperatures and an icy mix, which made for some perfect weather for a snowball fight that you saw before this video here. And then take a look at this video, though. It's too good to be true. It's so cute. Giant pandas at the National Zoo taking full advantage of all of that fresh powder sliding and rolling around. In Philadelphia, New York, Boston, all next to get hit by this nor'easter, and snow is already coming down there this morning. In New Jersey, roads are covered, and the state's transit authority is saying almost all services will be suspended today out of an abundance of caution. According to NBC New York, more than 70% of departures from JFK International have been canceled and 90% from LaGuardia have. And about a quarter of departures from Chicago were also canceled on Sunday. Meanwhile, we're in the middle of a warm spell here in the Twin Cities, but don't get too comfortable as Guy has been telling us all morning long that the coldest air of the season may be right around the corner. So get out and enjoy it while we have it. Now, this storm is also making headlines all day, so be sure to tune into the Today Show, uh, which is coming up here in about 20 minutes with the latest out east. But uh, pretty crazy for them. For us, it's been decent, yeah. at least for now. Isn't it nice that you see all that snow and it has nothing to do with us? Yeah. I know. Sorry, guys. <laughs>